What you thinking about, Spencer? Uh, just looking for something to make my car more noticeable. You got anything for me? Yeah, I think I can take care of that for you. will go out Thursday, November 9th. Be sure to go to your Rebel Time Advisory class. So Robin, do you like my new bracelet? I love it. Where'd you get it? The Spanish Club is selling them. They were made in Nicaragua. The profits are all 100% charitable and go towards giving children a better education. They are on sale now in the cafeteria, on the stage, or in Miss Sosa's room 14. They're going to be selling them until Wednesday afternoon. Wow, I'll have to check that out. Sounds really neat. Freshmen, please remember that there is a parent meeting tonight, starting at 6 p.m. in the cafeteria. We need laser light focus. State testing is in a short 10 days, and we need to be on top of things. Over the past week, the CTE classes have been hosting their fourth annual pumpkin badge. It has been a great experience for both the children and the CTE students involved. What's your favorite part about Pumpkin Patch and why? Well, um, I'm part of Miss Fry's culinary program and she has a food truck at Pumpkin Patch. So getting to work in like a fast paced environment, I feel like that's a really good job skill for in the future and I really enjoy doing that. Get to see the kids and all. All right, thank you. Okay. Bye. And, uh, come outside and be with friends and have fun. That work? Yeah. What is your favorite part about the pumpkin badge? Um, working with the animals. What do you feel like you're accomplishing by helping with the pumpkin badge? We made the kids' days and we made a really big impact. Okay, paint it. Now you can pick it. And then you're putting the different color blocks in it. Yeah, you move up. Go move up. So. Um, okay. What is your favorite part about the pumpkin badge? Well, I enjoy helping the kids and helping them pick out what they want and just making their days happy because like they just choose whatever they want and just go around helping them and it's a lot of fun to me. I just like I enjoy doing that kind of stuff. What do you feel like you're accomplishing by helping out with the pumpkin patch? Well, with business, we're fundraising for that program and a lot of other programs are doing the same thing. And um, so it's, it's really good for that purpose. All right. That yeah. yeah. What's your favorite part about Pumpkin Patch and why? My favorite part of the Pumpkin Patch is helping a kid's dream come true. That'll work. What's your favorite part about Pumpkin Patch and why? My favorite part about Pumpkin Patch was um, actually face painting because little kids were so excited to get their face painted even if... Go! Find a place to start! <laughs> go! I didn't go! Go! Get to a spot! 
He tried it. He's so here. cool. We can walk up here. I can't wait till next year's pumpkin patch. Now let's pass it to Paige for Rebel Rundown. Hi, I'm Paige and welcome back to Rebel Rundown. The varsity girls and boys basketball team play November 7th at Mary Montgomery. The game starts at 6. The varsity boys and girls soccer team also play the same night at Stone County. So if you're not able to make the basketball game, be sure to make the soccer game. Football has ended, and they're already working on building a new season. Now, back to Olivia and Robin. Thanks, Paige. Well, that's all, folks. Before we go, shout out to Jaden Bath and Cruise Beach. See you next time on GC Live. Okay.